What is this, YouTube? It is an awesome August update. Uh, I hope everyone is having fun with their goals. Um, this is an interesting video because there's good, there's bad, and there's ugly. Um, well, mostly just good and ugly. But anyways, uh, the good news, all these guys right here, uh, Mechanothralls, Biothralls, all of them are based and their metallics are done. Uh, I think they look fantastic. Uh, Scarlock is over here waiting uh, because he will get his um, skin tones at the same time they do. Um, bad side, I absolutely hate. Oh, let me move some of this out of the way. How these bases are coming out. Um, they just don't look like water to me. And so these guys back here are all going to get stripped as soon as Awesome August is over. All those bases will be um, redone and to do that I have to take everything off so they will be going into a chemical bath. I know it's sad but now that I have my technique down it shouldn't take too long to remake them. We can rebuild him! Uh, the good news, trolls! A um, friend of mine is getting into hordes so to help her out. And there's my cell phone. Um, I picked up the Trollbud starter box. Absolutely gorgeous models. Just a quick review of this. Uh, Ironhide, two impalers, and an axer. I built up his base a little bit. Um, he is pinned all the way through. So he's not going anywhere. Um, absolutely gorgeous. There's just a couple things to complain about. One, um, there's a rope, I don't think y'all can see it, going down the back of this model. And um, it didn't line up right even when you lined up this rope. No, you know, nothing a little bit of quick fix, you know, and I'll get into fixing here in a second. And then the axe or his hands didn't line up just right, but I think I got it. I think I nailed it. Um, and then the amazing is this stuff. Uh, big thanks to the guy, I don't know your name, but over on the Privateer Press forums who uh, told me where to get it. Hobby Lobby for $7.99, standard yellow-gray. Sir, you are a gentleman and a scholar. Just thought you should know that. Um, but basically what I did, put a little ball of it, got it wet. Uh, learned this from Massive Voodoo, Roman over there. He is a champion as well. Uh, go check out his blog. I'll put a link down here. Um, or actually, I'll put it down down there in the bottom uh, for massive voodoo uh, to go see this technique but you basically water it down and you let it run down into the cracks and what because this totally means cracks and finger talk um, but like a good example of this would be like let's see if I get way back and then zoom way in on the stomach here that gap is virtually gone after two or three passes I mean absolutely fantastic work um, or it works fantastically I should say so check it out guys Awesome August is going um, I'm thinking about going more of this route with the bases and then putting some static grass and some some little doodads on there because um, I really like that color of dirt um, to get that dirt color it's really easy here's my formula uh, dark flesh tone dry brush peg brown um, dry brush dwarf skin then some written flesh. I don't know what the translation to uh, Vallejo is um, on for the written flesh because that's a privateer press color. But there are your three numbers if you want to do it. If you want to follow along, there you go. Um, derp -a -derp. Picked up some of this uh, crackle medium that I'm going to be using on the trolls bases. I'm going to put them in like a desert. We'll see how that works. I don't know. Uh, this is pretty much where this army is going to be for a while. Just just until me and her get a, get um, get our hands around it. So we figured it out. These guys are going to be very brightly colored. We'll see how that goes. Um, I think that's all I got. Let's see how I'm doing on time. Ooh, I got to go to work soon. So Milliput, standard gray yellow. Highly recommend. Uh, trolls, gorgeous models. Um, metallics wonderfully done, bases suck. Oh well. Can't win them all, right? Uh, but you live, you learn. Uh, the biggest problem I have with it is the fog on them, as you can see. 
that little that white stuff around the rim it looks gross um, so there you go guys and that's after like four days of drying so I'm less than impressed um, oh well live and learn like I said I'll get to repaint them yay that'll be awesome um, derp -derp. there you go trolls by the way this guy has a weird head I don't know how I feel about it this guy has an awesome head uh, I like it so alright that's your update for today. Go back up. Bye.